Hey guys, so I recently purchased the Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette and this is the look I came up with. So if you want to see how I did this, then just keep watching. So I already have foundation on and I'm going to take my Face of Australia eye primer and that's going to go all over my lids. Getting my eyes ready for shadow. Then I'm going to take the NYX eye pencil in milk and that's going to go on my tear duct. And I'm just going to use the warmth of my finger to kind of blend that in and pat it down. Next I'm taking the Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette and I'm taking the colour White Chocolate and I'm using this as a brow bone highlight. A lot of people do this last but I actually do it first because I have the tendency to over blend and if I put that shadow there first it's kind of insurance so if I do over blend it will at least blend nicely and I can kind of salvage it. Then I'm going to take the colour Marzipan and just using a flat eyeshadow brush that I'm going to pack that colour onto my lid. Then I'm going to take the colour Hot Chocolate and that's going to go on my crease just with a fluffy crease brush. That's a Sonia Kashuk one and I love it. Doesn't have to be perfect because we're going to blend it later. Just as long as it's relatively even on both eyes. I'm going to take that colour just underneath my lower lash line as well. Then I'm going to take the colour Triple Fudge and I'm going to use that on my outer V with that same brush. Now I'm going to take a fluffy blending brush and I'm going to blend it all in. And take lots of time doing it because, yep, that's why. <laughs> so I'm just kind of blending it all in, smoking it out. Next I'm using the colour Champagne Truffle and that's going to go over that white in my tear duct. Then I'm going to put some eyeliner on. I like to use gel eyeliner with an angled brush but everyone does their eyeliner differently. And I'm going to wing it out. Um, it was going to be a small wing and then ended up, ended up as a big wing. <laughs> Doesn't really matter, do what you want. Um, my eyeliner length and thickness always depends on how steady my hand is that day. And I'm going to do my lower waterline as well. And with that brush it's pretty hard to not smudge it so I always just use my finger and kind of wipe it away. It's smoky and smudgy anyway so it doesn't really matter that much. Then I'm going to use mascara. Um, you can use false lashes if you want, I was actually going to, but when I was filming this I could not find a single pair of false lashes in the house, if you can believe that. Then I'm going to use the Benefits Browsings in the colour Dark and I'm going to do my brows. Normally I use a brow pencil as well underneath it, but I actually couldn't find it. <laughs> so I'm just using that, that will have to suffice brows normally look better than they do in this video, I like to think, but they still look okay. Then, would you look what happened, my brush was too close to my eyeliner brush and that happened. <laughs> so I'm just trying to fix it up and bronzing my face. Why did I say it like Borat? My face. <laughs> Taking the NYX powder in caramel and I'm using this to contour, just basically putting it over the top of where I put my bronzer. I am doing it a little bit heavier than normal just so it will show up on camera. Then I'm going to take the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in the colour Cheeky Bronze and I'm putting this slightly above my contour just for a nice bronzy highlight and my Illuminator is dying. It's a Victoria's Secret one. I love it. It gives a really beautiful glow. 
Uh, this is a MAC Spice Lip Pencil and I am just lining my lips with that. Looks really insane up close like that. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm going to fix it. Then I'm going to take MAC Smith Lipstick and that's going over the top. And because I'm so pale, that colour kind of washes me out a little bit. So I have to use something with some colour on top of it. So I use NYX's Strawberry Milk and I'm going to put that right on the top. And as you can see it looks pretty heavy and porn starry. So I'm just taking some blotting paper and just blotting it right down until I get it how I want it. Taking that highlight again, putting it over the top just to give it some dimension. And I forgot about blush. I'm just taking this pink blush and putting that on the face. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Bye.